Thank you for watching, liking, commenting, sharing, and subscribing right now. Got a question here that was asked either on LockerGnome.net, possibly in a YouTube comment thread. Maybe someone asked me on Twitter, at Chris Perillo or at LockerGnome, if you include that in a tweet, I, I should be able to pick it up. May have been asked on Bean, but I, suddenly I turned Canadian. May have been asked uh, somewhere on uh, Facebook.com slash Chris Perillo. Either way, the question came in. And the question was a very clear one. What was the first social networking site you ever joined? I had to think about this. Uh, first of all, I'll ask you, what was the first social networking site that you ever joined? And it, it so helped me. If you say, oh, it's Facebook, you're way too young. <clears throat> I got online for the first time uh, in 1992, and uh, that is when I, I got onto a BBS and I would consider this BBS a social network because we networked socially. Uh, wasn't a lot to do there. We could, you know, type back and forth. Uh, couldn't really send naked pictures of ourselves. We kind of had to type it out in ASCII. You know, I'm well endowed. I have a lot of dots. There were no graphics on the internet back in the day. You'd have to download them over a modem. You were lucky to have a 2400 baud modem at that point. Either way, this BBS was called ISCA. And ISCA was based at the University of Iowa. I went to the University of Nowhere Important. I'm sorry, UNI, University of Northern Iowa. I, I've known only like three other people. We, there were three of us who went to that university. And uh, two of them are still there. It's kind of sad. Either way, uh, we, we, we logged in uh, to ISCA. We telemedded. Originally, we used t the Telnet protocol, and then later on, we got a client, and we used the client. And, and here's the thing: at one point, you're gonna love this, right? ISCA got so popular in about I think it was 1993 or so. It got so popular, I, I want to say it could only have 200 or 400 users on at one time, just a handful. Like maybe maybe it was maybe it was more than that. Maybe it was a thousand or two thousand. Either way, they capped it at some insanely low number, and then you would have to wait in a queue before you could log in. Like you'd have to wait. Your number currently in queue. Your number two hundred thirty-three. Oh, I gotta wait to log in to see my friends. <laughs> I kid you not. It's cool. Oh, it's, it's, you know when I had my account. Uh, up until a couple years ago, and I just hadn't logged in, I, I used to be the Locker Gnome, three words, the Locker Gnome, in, uh, it was 1992, I set that up, and I was user number, like, 29,000 on ISCA. I guess it was an early adopter, because they, they, they're definitely pushing. I mean, I remember seeing, you know, six-figure usernames, high six-figure usernames. So, I tend to join a lot of these social networks pretty early on. And uh, that would be uh, the first that would have been there. I'm Canadian for you there. Yay, Canada. I, I've i been to Canada. I'm not There's nothing wrong with what you guys are doing up there, really. Uh, I just wonder, when are you just going to make it official? Just become another state? <laughs> Might as well. Ha! Come on. Come on. Everybody's doing it. You can make sound effects like that. Eh, even bring your toques. <clears throat> Either way, and by the way, we'll even take your Canadian Tire money down here as well, if you want. Or Freddy and Eddie Shreddy. You can bring them, too. <clears throat> I, I, I've been doing this stuff for a, way too long. Uh, you know, that was the first uh, social network I joined, ISCA. Any, any other people from ISCA? They even had an ISCA -nic, they a picnic. I never went to it. I was kind of afraid. <laughs> Quite a, why would I go and meet people I met online? That's kind of strange. I never did that. Uh, then I, I, you know, if you're, if, that would be the first one. But uh, you know, of course, sites came up, websites came around, and, and, and social networking came on vogue. Uh, I joined Rise and Orkut, and I mean all the early ones uh, that were around. Um, and and I, I doubt that any of you would even remember those. So, uh, yeah, I've been doing this for way longer than a lot of you have even been online. And that's a good thing. So when I talk about a lot of this technology and the trends and stuff, I kind of know what I'm doing. Kind of. Not always. Just kind of. Not every day. Kind of.
seen it. Not about everything. Suddenly I'm channeling Don Knotts. All right, before I pop out another impression, my email address, chris at perillo.com. Feel free to leave a comment here wherever you're, you're watching the video, you're commenting in the blog, I don't care. What was your first social network? Did you create a social network that nobody joined? Ha <laughs> ha! Was it very social, was it? Sorry, that was a little antisocial behavior. I was itching my leg. It was my leg. An itch over here. On this side of my body. Not in the middle. At Chris Perillo on Twitter. Uh, also got the blog, chris.perillo.com. Um, doing videos just about every day. Uh, been doing it for a long time. A lot longer than YouTube's been here, really. Uh, let's see here. Uh, what, what else do I need to tell you? Uh, you can follow me on Orkut. I still have an account there. Uh, you can follow me... Well, well, the Facebook fan page is good enough for for everybody, really. I even push my parents there. Uh, let's see here. Where else can... Where else can you follow? Honestly, there's not a single place on the web you couldn't follow. I'm even on Bebo! I think I, I... I had Bebo for like... I had it. And never... No one ever... Apparently I have no European friends. Uh, MySpace.com slash LockerDome. How many friends am I up to now? I, I, uh... I only friend people who have, uh... Toilets in their profile pics. Whether they mean to or not. Not that I'm a friend of pl plumbers. I'm not to say that if you're a plumber, I wouldn't be your friend. I mean, I, I, I need a plumber right now. Actually, my, my toilet's whistling. It's crazy. It's like... It doesn't breathe, of course, because this is a toilet. And if my toilet started breathing, oh, God, I'd, I'd move. Okay, enough. Feel free to geek out with the rest of the nerds in the chat room. They're there right now and you can be there too it's part of a live video feed going out over the web 24 hours a day seven days a week at live.perillo.com we'll see you later